Hi everyone, thanks for stopping by. Happy Mother's Day! I wanted to take a minute to tell all of my moms happy, happy Mother's Day and remind you that you are so important. Your family would not function as well as it does without you. Being a mom is such a hard and important job, and God entrusted that job to mom. We are the only ones who can set the tone in our home the way that we do. We are the only ones who can calm a child the way that we do. We have special influence over our kids, over our husband, and over the overall atmosphere in our home. And that is so, so important. And it's easy to forget sometimes because yeah, we're human. We get frustrated, we have bad days, we get overwhelmed and we get burnt out. And then we beat ourselves up and feel guilty about feeling burnt out and feeling overwhelmed. And it's just silly. God has placed us in our homes for a reason. There's nobody who can do the job as a mom for your kids, as a wife for your husband better than you. You are made for your family and you are made for this job and you're doing it well. Even on days when you feel like you're struggling, you feel like you can't take any more, you're gonna rip your hair out of your head, you're going crazy. You got this. There's a scripture in Proverbs that I absolutely love and it talks about when you open your mouth, you speak with wisdom and you give instruction with kindness. And that is my goal for how I parent. I want to give my kids wisdom and I want to instruct them and teach them with kindness. I want to be gentle with my kids. I want to teach them gently. Does that mean that I always am? No. <laughs> Does it mean that I'm always calm and collected? No. Does it mean that I never raise my voice? No. I'm human. I get upset. I get frustrated. I lose my temper. But... God's grace is sufficient for me, and it's definitely sufficient for you. God's going to help us if we ask him to help us, and we are genuinely trying the best that we can to treat our children the way that Jesus wants us to treat our children. And he's going to help us, and we can ask him for help. If you're feeling burnout, I strongly suggest that you look at yourself spiritually and emotionally and physically. Make sure that your needs are being met because you can't pour from an empty cup. Serving our families is exhausting, but if we don't take care of ourselves, we're not gonna have anything left to give. So make sure that you're taking care of you this Mother's Day. Whether you take 15 minutes to take a bath after the kids go to bed, or to read a book, or if you just wanna listen to a podcast or something, do something just for you for five minutes, 10 minutes if you can, just to replenish yourself, your mind, relax. Get a massage if you can, or go get a pedicure, whatever the case may be. Do something just for you. Take care of you so that you can better serve your family. And don't feel guilty for taking some time out for yourself, for spending a little bit of money on yourself if you have it. You need time to relax. You need time to take care of you. It's Mother's Day after all. Enjoy your day. There's nobody better qualified to serve and love your family than you. You are doing an amazing job. Keep up the good work. Have a wonderful, happy, happy Mother's Day from me to you.